Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at an awesome new brand of travel trailer made by Grand Design that has an awesome bunk room setup. This is the 2022 Grand Design Transcend Explorer model 297QB. We are going to take a look at some of the outside features first, then the inside features. Then we're going to give you three things we love about this unit and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. I am super excited to show you this brand new Grand Design Explore. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Will. Hey Will! Hey guys! How's it going today? It's going good. I am extra excited to review this because um, we're here at um, Explore USA in San Antonio. Yes. Where we met the Donovans, is that right? <laughs> yes. Yeah, okay, and they just bought this Grand Design. Congratulations. So, yeah, huge congrats to them. And hopefully they still love their Grand Design after we give our review. Three <laughs> things we like and three things we don't like. Well, That's right. let's begin. Model is the Grand Design 297. The actual tip to tip length of this travel trailer is 35 feet 11 inches. The dry weight is 7,190 pounds, and well, that hitch weight is 749 pounds. This is the Transcend, this is Grand Design's entry-level travel trailer, but it's perfect for so many reasons. Right up here, we do have a power tongue jack, propane tanks, and your batteries go there. Now, when we call this entry-level, what we mean is typically, it's aluminum corrugated sides like that with wood framing. This one does have the optional fiberglass so Correct. It, it's really nice it's not super lightweight for the size but it is kind of lightweight and it's just a good quality in anything grand design can make a pop-up and it's going to be a phenomenal pop-up you know that's right saying? yeah coming on down the side here we do have manual stabilizing jacks very nice pasture storage look at that well held up by a magnet very nice that crv wasn't held up by a magnet i know right <laughs> coming on down the side here we don't have frameless windows we do have a very good sized power awning with LED lights. And Will, look at this. I know. I thought Grand Design was getting with the times. The aluminum fold up steps. We love the solid steps, the ones that fold up. But we'll come to that a little bit later. Coming on down the side here, we do got potable water fill. Potable. Potable. Outside TV. And look at here. Notice how you won't see any insulation packages right. or whatever. Um, this unit's not made for Four Seasons. This is made for Texas. That's right. It's made for Florida. You know what I'm saying? It's not made for extreme cold weather camping. So yeah. if you want to live in an RV, you don't want to live in this one. You want to live, you don't even want to really live in an Imagine. You want to live in like a reflection. You know what I'm yep. saying? And then look at these tires welded to Westlakes. I love those. ST225-75R15. And I like those black rims. We said that last time. Do you not like those black rims, Will? Not really. Really? <laughs> they look a little cheap to me, but. Oh, I think they look cool. Coming on down, but I also drive an orange truck, so <laughs> my definition of cool might be different than your definition. Yeah. Right here, we do have a nice little mini fridge. A little area right here with power. And then right here, it's a little cooktop. Perfect. Nice little capital grill. Great for getting it done. You know what I'm saying? Right. Very nice. Coming around the back, we do have a nice bumper for your stinky slinky. Spare tire, spare tire carrier. And then check this out, Will. Nice storage. Yeah. There you go. Very good that amount of storage. Nice. And check this out does have a ladder to get up on the roof. Ladder capacity, 300 pounds. Nice. Very nice. Well, also prep for a backup camera. Okay. Let's go up there and take a look. All right. Here we go now. Up here on the roof, you can see we have a nice one-piece TPL roof. Not one, but two air conditioning units. I love that. There's your WineGuard 360 digital antennas. Place for Max Air fans. I'm right up there. You can see that there's a solar panel already on the roof. Cool. Great. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys smash the thumbs up button. What other RV salesman's taking his fat ass up on a Donovan's roof? Showing you what features the roof the Donovan's units have. Nobody. <laughs> Nobody. I don't even know if I said that right. Right. 
right over here. 50 amp service. Nice. I love that. I love that. I do too. Well, we should review this Prowler next. Okay. Look at it. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Right over here, Will. It's where we dump our tanks. Black and gray tank. Okay. Here's your black tank flush. Water heater right here. And right over here, Will. It's the other side of the storage. Potable waterfall again. Potable, potable. A uh, battery disconnect, everything. There's some higher end stuff that you see on, again, more entry level. But again, that's what Grand Design does. When you yeah. get Grand Design, you're not getting entry level. That's right. You're getting the Grand Design. That's right. Flip the switch. What switch? Oh, yes. Battery. Turn the battery on. Trying to conserve battery life yes, here. Sir. Yes, sir. Well, well, the outside of the Transcend looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. All right. See me skip in front of flow over there. <laughs> All right. Low front progressive. Bedroom up front here. Coming down to that bathroom. Well, I'm super excited for this review because I've never seen a floor plan like this. Right. Kitchen here, living area, dining area. Yep. And all the way in the back is, wow, this is a cool bunk room. Cool, where are we starting? Oh, uh, we're gonna start right in the middle, but okay. first let's give a big shout out to our sponsor, Lipper. Sounds good. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by Lipper. Did you guys know Lipper does so much more than axles and chassis? They actually make a whole bunch of RV lifestyle aftermarket products. I have three chairs that I wanna show you guys today. The first chair is the super popular zero gravity chair. This chair, you can lean all the way back, you can relax it, you can, you, you, you just feel like you're in space with zero gravity. It's an awesome chair, and I know that's one of the best sellers. Then there's my personal favorite, which is a traditional fold-up chair. What I do like is that the all four stay sturdy, but you can pitch the back back so you can lock into your favorite place. And then finally, Will's favorite chair, the big bear chair. This is good for all the big guys out there or anybody who just wants an extra large chair. Thank you so much to Lipper for sponsoring this video. We actually have links down below on where you can pick up some of these chairs. Let's continue the video. Wow, well, again, I don't even know where to begin. Do we begin on this side? Do we begin on this side? I don't know. Uh, here's what I do know. Actually, you know what? I'm lying. We're gonna We're start, gonna start back. back here. Yep. Wow, look at this. Very nice. Oh yeah. Good size bunk Yeah, area. I like that. Adult size, you got the beds right here that kind of go like this and like that. Nice little window, good padding and everything. Little place right there if your little one needs a CPAP machine, just cause. <laughs> they can set up their iPads and cell phones there. Right over there, that's where a TV would go. You got a coat hanger and then look at those storage. Nice drawers. Yes very nice drawers and then there's drawers under there too oh would you look at that well ain't it neat yes sir and then right over here nice little pocket door yes pocket very nice then coming into the living room i guess this would be pantry space for the kitchen so yeah kind of in a weird spot but this is a weird travel trailer yeah so right over here we do got the Thomas Paine Collection theater seats. Right here, you hit recline. You got the cup holders here. Okay. Three cup holders, a little place for the uh, remote controls. Then you got windows here, windows here, and the balances. Very and, nice. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And what's really nice about these theater seats, one, people can walk through in between. You know oh, right, saying? right. You're right. And then two, it is directly across from that TV entertainment center. Yes. The TCL. Storage on one side, storage on the other side. Yep. With the Furion, it can sync to your phone. Nice TV. And then look at this table. They're doing like the live edge action going on. Very nice. This it's like a the, wide table too. Yeah, it is a little bit of a wide table or my belly's getting bigger <laughs> or a little bit of both. But I'll show this real quick, Will, just so people can see. Okay, and you know, pause. Yep, the grand design difference. Three year structural warranty, of course. Nice window right here. So we always talk about how great frameless windows are, but you can't do that on a frameless you window. You can't, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So definitely pros and cons. And then underneath here, Will, we got storage right underneath there. Okay. Do you mind showing the storage underneath there? Of course. Right here. 
Yes, sir. And then also, just so everybody does know, this table, this table does drop down to make a bed. Very nice. Will, would you like to show us the kitchen? Of course, but before I do, I want to give a quick reminder. We are now partnered with RV Retailer, which is a nationwide network of dealers, just like Explore USA here in Texas. So if you're looking at this unit or any unit, make sure to go to our website, mattsreviewreviews.com. Yes. Fill out one of the three contact me forms. Matt and I will personally oversee everything to make sure you get an awesome sales price. Oh, Great service, yes, and just the best overall buying experience in the industry. And let me tell you guys something: Grand Designs an amazing partner with RVR. Yes. So every region they sell Grand Design. They do. Like if if you're a dealership for sale, right? If you're selling your dealership and you hold Grand Design, RVR is going to buy you. Right. You know. Right. And we can um get really good pricing on them. Yep. Max family might save like ten grand. Well, not me. No, the not my Matt, family. Sorry. My family, my Our family. Would, Matt. Yeah, my family would never buy a Grand Design. Come on, no, <laughs> my family wouldn't buy an RV. Are you serious? No. Our friend Matt. Yeah. Um, okay, nice compressor refrigerator here. Yes. And freezer so says 12 volt works off of propane. I mean, just electric. Oh nice. snap! Oh, yeah. Yep. Furion microwave right here. Well, Furion everything. Furion range hood. Yes. Um, nice or no backsplash, but a little bit of counter space here. A nice Furion cooktop right here and oven with the yes. lights and a drawer underneath. And then, well, you forgot about our kibble station. Oh, I right did, there. yeah. It's for all your. Oh, oh no, no, that's kibble just station. storage. Just storage. Okay. Over here, some nice storage there. Yes, sir. Nice storage here. Okay, okay. In there as well. Yes. Little storage nook there. Not solid surface countertops. Again, not at this price point or this weight. Right. Nice little spray faucet. Big single bowl sink. Look at the countertops on both sides yeah. as well. Very yeah. good. Storage. Yes. All underneath. Nice little spot for your sponge. Yes. More storage there. Another drawer. And to wrap it all up. Really, there's well, actually... Well, we're not wrapping it up yet. <laughs> there's a little bit more. Yeah, so a little more countertop space there. Oops, sorry. Oh, the disrespect. Well, the disrespect. A couple drawers here. Yep. And then, like, What's a little that? shoe Shoes? holder, I okay, guess. Okay, okay. Yeah, whatever you want to do with cool. it. Cool. All right, well, it's now time for the shower test. Okay. You're going in the Donovan shower. <laughs> wow, that's 30 by 36, Well. Yeah, good size shower. See, I knew there'd be a problem with the height. Yeah. But the width and the girth is This totally is great. Yeah. yeah, especially for this size. Can you pass it or no? I think I can, yeah, because, cool. you know, I can definitely wash my hair and get get everything in there. It's a barely pass, but I'm going to pass it. Bing! Hey, doesn't matter if you pass by an inch or a mile. Passing's passing. That's and right. failing is failing. Where's the dang light? Right there. Right here, we do have a nice medicine cabinet. Okay. A uh, nice little sink action. A little bit of storage underneath there. Okay. A little drawer and a little more. All right, Donovans. All comes down to this. Wow. Undisputable. This is a prime poop position. Ding! Very nice. It's actually a great placement. Right. They did a kick butt job there. And I'm loving all these pocket doors. Yeah. The pocket doors. Okay. Into the master uh, bedroom. Right over here. Here's where uh, they're gonna have all their storage. Couple drawers. Right here, right here. And then uh, over here, Will, we do got storage. nice storage. Yeah, out on this side. Yes, Same sir. thing here. Yes, sir. Uh, what do we got go over there? A little nook underneath. Yep. Headboard action. Yep. Uh, good size bed, fully walk aroundable bed. Yes, that's nice. Yep. Second AC. Yes, sir. Okay, there's also power and uh, USB on this side. Is it on that side? It is. Okay, Just cool. power, no USB. Okay, okay. And then we got storage underneath there. Cool. Well, well, everybody's dying to know what the MSRP is on this unit. But before we do that, we have to give three things we like about it and three things we don't like about it. Will, what do we do first? You okay there? Yeah, I was making sure the AC was ducted mm. back in there. It's not ducted in here, but it is yeah. ducted back there, which is good. Again, um, I was surprised that it had two ACs to begin with. Right. Let's do three things we dislike. Okay. I feel like I had one or two outside. You did, yeah. Oh, yeah, first one. Do you have any inside? Well, I do, actually. Okay, you yeah. go first. We mentioned it, but 
just to reiterate, this pantry is really random. A weird spot. Yes. Like I don't know why they didn't shift all this down. And right. Put the pantry there. Didn't make any sense. Yeah. It's um. Weird. Not a big dislike. No. But a dislike's a dislike. That's right. That's number one. Well, number two is always going to be these solid steps. Yes. Or these uh, aluminum steps. Now, these aluminum steps are just fine. And if you're going to not have solid steps, it is the steps that we prefer. But we always prefer solid steps. That's an absolute must. And then, uh, well, do you have a number three? Um, are you going to talk about the tire, the rims? No, that's not that big okay, of a deal. Okay, good, good, good. I was about to say. So then, I'll do number three, Will. Okay. I feel like... You know what it is? It's gonna sound a little weird. Too much white on the outside. Yeah. Like they should have done the pattern of the aluminum. Right, logo. right. Like you see that? It's just a little plain Jane for me over here from this point on. Also, I'll combo that because that's not good enough. I'll combo it. I wish they had an awning, like a bigger awning. Like yeah, put give me like or two, two awnings. awnings yeah. yeah. Give me like an awning over there and an awning over here. But at least where this awning is, it is under the door. Which it is, is very and, nice. And the door swings out of the way. Uh-huh. Great. So that's three things we don't like about it. Will, now it's time for three things we love about this travel trailer. Would you like to go first or me? You can go first. All right. I'm going inside. Okay. First things first, I love this whole living room setup. Very unique, very different, and that's what I like. So many times, guys, you guys don't understand. Will and I, we do hundreds of reviews, thousands of reviews. And um, just to see the whole plain Jane floor plan time in and time out is boring. And so I love this floor plan. Yes. That's number one. I do have number two. Okay. Back here. You guys know I actually don't like it when it's like the half bunk room, right? I like right. the full on bunk room. But here's what I will say. This setup and everything is the best half bath, half bunk room or whatever you want to call it that I've seen. I love this lower bed here. I love just the way the whole setup is and the storage. Yep. You actually have space and a door for privacy. Yeah, I agree. That's number two. And then, well, number three. Okay, for mine, we've said it before, but I love that all the appliances are Furion. Yes. Um, you know, we've said it before, but it just makes it so nice when you have issues, you're calling Furion, not yep. five different places. And again, like one Furion's great, they're a sponsor of the show, but it's not yeah. about that. It could be Magic Chef everything, right? And we love it. It could be on. Um, it is a double play. I do feel like Furion is definitely top of the line for sure. One, so it's like a double, yes. You know, pro, but again, but still, even if it was all Magic Chef, yep, we it's all about that know, brand consistency. Exactly, and that is what we love. Well, well, do you know what time it is? It's now time for, for the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this unit here is. $43,430, Will, MSRP, sale price, we can't advertise sale price because it's a 2022 Grand Design, and Grand Design doesn't let us, but Will, yes. the Donovans didn't come here to pay MSRP. That's right. They came here to get a lot better price than that, and again, guys, if you're interested in this Grand Design or any Grand Design, Go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. Will, yep. we have New England, we have North Carolina, we have Florida, we have Texas, we got Washington, we got California. All these areas, we got um Colorado, all these areas will sell and represent Grand Design, guys. Yep. So if you're in the market for any Grand Design, go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out that contact tab. We're going to hook you up with the closest partner to you, and we're going to make sure you get a phenomenal deal. That's right. Will, is there anything you'd like to say? Yeah, guys, you, you know that we love Grand Design. Grand Design builds such a great uh, trailer. Make sure to leave down in the comments below. Let us know the three things you like, three things you dislike. Make sure to smash the thumbs up button and subscribe. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And we'll, we'll see you next time. time.